when I am down and oh my soul so weary when troubles come and my heart burns. Here in this church, oefened the tenor Daniel Rodriguez. He was in America bekend as the singing policeman when he worked for police in New York. He made the shocking accusations of 11 September 2001. Na een optreden tijdens de herdenkingsbijeenkomst voor de slachtoffers van de aanslagen, werd hij ontdekt door de Spaanse operazanger en dirigent Placido Domingo. When I hear him singing the national anthem, I already knew that it was a quality voice, you know. Deze bood hem aan om lessen te komen nemen. Inmiddels heeft Rodriguez een aantal albums op zijn naam staan en geeft hij tal van concerten. Vandaag is hij in Nederland om te oefenen voor een concert in Apeldoorn. You raise me up to more than I can be. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. I didn't know we had an audience. <laughs> you have. Hi, Miriam. Hi, Miriam. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hi, Martin. Oh, Zo, klopt Hi. fantastisch. It's my favorite song. Thank you. Really, Thank it's you. beautiful. Yeah, that was oh. beautiful, Martin. Fantastic. So, welcome in Holland. Oh, thank you. It's good to be here. Yes? Uh, ik ben blij terug te zijn. Ah, heel oh, goed. Uh, heel goed. Yes. <laughs> Can you tell me, um, when did you start singing? Oh, I think I started singing before I could talk. Is it? My, my mother used to tell stories that when I was a little boy, they used to put me on the table. I used to put me on the kitchen table and I would sing and I would dance. I was about two years old, always thinking I'm going to have this big career, a big famous uh, uh, rock star, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> when I was 20 years old, I started a family. And um, I think I think the sudden, suddenly becoming a father and suddenly, um, suddenly stopping music because I had to go to work, um, caused me to despair. Now the choir comes in, oh, and the song to say, okay. And so I began to drink, and I became an alcoholic. I was um, living on the street, and um, I, I lost, you know, I lost my wife, and uh, my children, I didn't see my children for a long time, and, um, and uh, it was a very, very dark time in my life. So and I went into the bathroom and there was a big mirror in the bathroom and I looked in the mirror and the reflection that I saw was death. My eyes were black, my skin was ash, my face was sunk and I saw, I saw my own death. And I remember something that my aunt told me when I was a young boy. She held my hand and she said, God has something special for you. I don't know what it is, and you'll know when it happens, but God has something special for you. And I never remembered that until that moment. And that moment, I fell to my knees and I asked God, I said, if you can raise me from this floor, if you can raise me from my knees, then I will try and be the man that you always wanted me to be. It was uh, many, many years later when I joined the police force. That was the biggest decision I made for my career. But you also were a policeman at the day of 9-11. Yes. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me something about your experience that day? Well, that morning, um, I was on my way to work and I was crossing the Verrazano Bridge and I saw the first tower was on fire. There was one moment uh, where I made a decision that saved my life, is the reason I'm here today. It's, and and I, I know that that day was when God spoke to me and I was, I was getting, coming out of the battery tunnel and to make a right hand turn would be to be in ground zero. To make a left hand turn was where headquarters is. Just before I made the right-hand turn, something said to me, let someone know where you're going. 
And so instead of making the right, I made a left. And I went to headquarters. And um, I, I was about a block away from the towers when they came down. God had given me a gift and that's what I needed to give. And the call came for me to share that gift when um, uh, the mayor, Mayor Giuliani, called me and said they're going to do a big service in Yankee Stadium and they want me to sing God Bless America. And that's when I knew that's what I was meant to do all my life. Oh, say can you see God is the ultimate power in the universe. And when you tap into the ultimate power, then you know, there's, there's nothing you can't do. Yeah. Oh, you have a lot of power when you raise. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a big voice, too. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's a big voice. No, it's fantastic. Thank you. I Thank wish you, you all the luck and blessings. Thank you very Good luck much. with the concert. In de maand mei geeft Daniel Rodriguez nog drie concerten in ons land. Voor meer informatie, eeuw.nl, schuine streep, door de